Well, YouTube, uh, a little bit of a vlog here just to kind of show you where I'm at with my garage. Uh, here's the door as you come in, and right next to this is the shelving that used to be over on this wall that uh, went over the top of my bench that I used to do quite a bit of stuff on, especially woodworking stuff. Now, there is my uh, refrigerator that kind of houses a lot of my paints and things like that. Uh, still got a little bit of a mess going, but you'll see that later. All right, next to that, I got a little cupboard complete with uh, flowers and birdies. Actually got that out of the garage at my mom's house. She wasn't using it anymore, and I thought, I eh, made a nice little cabinet that'll go over the sink here, which is kind of uh, framed in. It's not finished, but it's where it's going to be for a little while. Uh, up above that I got a shelf full of uh, tins and things to put stuff in. Then I got a door here. I uh, put a 2x4 on the wall, put a door there. I actually got uh, a couple of 2x4s holding that up to a rafter there. So uh, it seems pretty sturdy. I did actually, because it's a door and it's hollow, kind of put a spacer under there. Um, and I am going to bring this all the way down the wall here just to give me good places to put that kind of stuff. Uh, I got my kind of a washing station here. It's uh, for, you know, cleaning stuff, parts and things. I uh, just kind of built a little uh, shelf and, uh, I don't know, a little table there to set it on top of out of just scrap stuff I had. Now, uh, this isn't all going to stay this way. This is just kind of where I'm at right now. And uh, it's slowly but surely coming together. This is all just stuff I got hanging here on the wall for now, just because I'm using it to kind of work on the rest of it. Now, uh, right there is where the refrigerator was. And the Mustang is right where I'm standing right now. Anyhow, then we got the 12-ton uh, Harbor Freight press right there. Next to that, I got my drill. And that cabinet right there is actually in the same place it was, only facing this direction instead of that direction. And then the cabinets, I've done some videos on these. Uh, you probably won't have seen them yet. And they are definitely not done, but they are usable right now. Uh, and I'm just kind of getting organized and I got them back in this corner where uh, no man's land or the uh, corner of no return was uh, Back in the day where I used to shove everything and it never came out now I'm gonna have it be one of those areas that actually I work in and I'm right next to my window So I can look out my window when it's a pretty day out like right now. I've got my window open There's my trophies cuz I'm awesome <laughs> Uh, then the compressor. The compressor actually used to be further over in front of the window here and now I put it over kind of over this way. Now here's where we have kind of a mess going. I actually put my tire machine right here which is not being used right now. Uh, a couple of welders which I don't think you guys have ever actually seen but I've had forever. Um, the actually one's my grandfather's on the top there. One on the bottom was one I traded for a paint job a long time ago. Uh, and this is just under, alright, I thought of the word, loft. It's under the loft here. Uh, sometime I'm hoping to get rid of that altogether, and uh, I have plans in the future for that, but for right now, not really. And here's the uh, battery box. I don't know if you've seen that video yet. Uh, if you haven't, go check it out. It will probably be out, but I'm not positive, because it's being more difficult than I thought it would be. Um, and I just kind of have a couple saw horses with another door on top of it uh, for right now to kind of work on. Gives me a place to work because I got all this crap still here, but it's still a lot better than it was. Got a fan because it was 80 degrees out yesterday. It is now 60 something degrees out today, but it's still kind of a nice day. Uh, and all this is pretty much exactly the same as it was, only still kind of a mess. Right here is the Mustang. And my saw, still doing some work. Uh, I just kind of put these up today, so to try and get a bunch of stuff from 
out of the middle of the garage here there's the motorcycle and uh, so I'm still working on it it's coming along it's taken some time but I've had to kind of stop doing this to both do projects like that to get stuff off the floor and out of the way so I can get this Mustang over back kind of in its spot and I want to go camping and I don't want my batteries and my uh, tanks uh, propane tank stole so I'm building uh, locking mechanisms for those both of those things haven't started the propane tank thing yet so go check that out keep an eye out for that actually because I haven't started it and uh, like I said this battery box if you if it's not out it'll be out here shortly uh, it'll probably be next week if I haven't already got it out Anyhow, uh, I just thought I'd kind of give you an idea of what was going on in the shop. Uh, I didn't, I don't know if I showed you this. I got my, over in the corner, I did a video on these shelves here. Kind of did the same thing with these, only I had to use some uh, brackets here instead for this side on, all the way up. And I do have plans to finish all this stuff off a little nicer. Um, I'm going to have a videos, like I said, on all this stuff. Um, but that's about it. It's coming together uh, slowly but surely. All right, this is Sam, Jack of All, Master of None. You all have a good one.